In this video, we're gonna look at how an upsell process would work using SamCart and Optimize Member. Now, some people have asked, what happens when someone purchases a membership plan, but then you offer another membership plan as an upsell? So that's what this video is gonna do. I'm gonna show you how the process works inside Optimize Member and how it overrides the, you know, the upsell so that you can offer an upsell to another membership level, like a premium membership level or another package if you wanted to. So what I've done, I've gone inside Optimize Member, I've created an, an additional package um, called Coaching, you can see it here. And I was gonna do it on the same level of membership. I might even change the level of membership. So let's say if you were doing a, a premium level, like another level of inside your membership site. One thing with Optimize Member is the higher this level is set, the user then has access to all of the other lower membership content. So someone on level five can access four and below, and then someone on level six can access five and below. So these um, levels of membership here, um, the higher the number, the, the content, the higher the number of the membership level, then they can access all the lower membership levels inside this membership. The way you get around restricting this even further is by using packages, which I've explained before. So these packages that we assign here. So what I might do this for this video actually is create a new, or the product I've created in SamCart, I'll use level six. So what we're doing is we're actually upgrading or they're upselling the member to another membership level. So I've created the package called Coaching and I've, I'll use this level six. So inside SamCart, I've created a new product called Coaching and its integration is set with the membership portal. I'm using the SamCut plan. This is what I'm now gonna to change to level six, and I'm gonna put them on the coaching package. So we'll update that. So we're, this is our additional product that we're gonna be upselling. Next thing I do is I've gone into upsells. I've created an upsell called coaching, which is telling it you know, the product which I'm upselling. A SamCut have videos on this, so I'm really just gonna skim over it for you. I'm not gonna show you everything I've gone through and built inside SamCut. So I've created an upsell called Coaching, basically, which works for our new product. And I've then created an upsell funnel, again, called Coaching, which is telling the process of the funnel. You can do various upsells and downsells inside SamCut. So you can, you can have quite complex upsell and downsell offers, okay? You can see there you've got five if you wanted to go that far. So I've created this upsell funnel. I've then gone in back into the product which I had called SamCut Videos. I've gone into um, advanced settings and I've told this product to use this upsell funnel if it's ever sold. So what is happening now is that anyone who purchases my SamCart Videos product is going to be offered my coaching upsell, which is the upsell package. So it's really just the step that they go through during the checkout and SamCart handles all the upsell um, you know, details on the back end. So what we'll do, we'll go over here, I'll go to my uh, sales page and I'll go through to my order form and I'll complete all the details for this purchase. Okay, so what I've done, I've filled out the details, I've used them, um, I've checked inside my optimized press site that this user doesn't exist, this email doesn't exist, so that can go through. And then we've got, I've put in the details and I've put in all the test credit card stuff. So what should happen now is we click place order, it should start processing and then we should be presented with our upsell offer. So fingers crossed, here we go, there it is, there's our upsell offer and this is the upsell product that I created inside SamCart and it's offering me this coaching package. So what should be happening now is on the back end is um, we've sold our first product, an optimized member would be still be waiting for that content to come through, you know, for that data, for the user details to be sent. So what happening is SamCart is now presenting us with this new offer, with this new product. So if I click add to my order, so what we should, what should actually be happening is, there we go, we're presented with our thank you page. So we're taken to our thank you page. Now, in the back end of the WordPress site, we'll go and look and I'll show you how this user has been created. So the process has worked here. We can see the thank you page that we're given. Right, so let's go over to the WordPress site where we were just now and we'll go to all users. Now you can see here, here's the new user, that's me, or the new user has joined. And you can see over on the right-hand side, custom capabilities or packages. These are, these are also the packages, uh, the custom capabilities is really the technical term used when you're sort of trying to um, 
when you're creating different areas inside your site, you'll see custom capabilities is the tag that's used in the short code. Um, for labeling terms, we've called them packages to make them easier to understand. So you can see here we've got ebook and coaching. Okay, so there's two packages. And you can also see here the role have been added to level six um, membership level. Now I didn't name that, I left it as level six. Now, so what's happened here is we've sold our first product, which is the ebook product. If you remember, we're selling the video, uh, the ebook or the videos for the first product here. And then we've upgraded with the upsell offer in place and we've then been added onto the coaching product that you can see here. So we've been added the custom capability. So this user, if they joined and took the upsell, they would be put onto the higher membership level that you chose if you chose that in your upsell and then you'd be also be adding them that new package. So inside Samcart, obviously you can do different things like you could keep them on the same membership level but just add them onto different packages or you can obviously remove them off a completely off a membership level and put them onto another membership level. And you can do the things with downsells as well as so if they were downselling something, you know, in a way they could sort of be downgrading. You could even downgrade their membership level and move them around, although it's kind of like an upsell process. You can do pretty much anything inside Samcart if you can choose the um, optimized member level and you can choose the package inside optimized member. Once you can choose them inside Samcart, then you can pretty much move members around or assign them different levels of access and different products. How this all comes into play is when you're building your membership site, you're, you can set different pages and even different pieces of content on one page, which people can view based off a tag, like a custom capability. If you've looked back at any of our interviews we've done, like Kirk from Option Alpha, he chooses to show like one dashboard in his membership site and different pieces of content within that dashboard can only be viewed depending on the membership level or the custom capability or the package that's being used in his membership site. Now he is also using a different membership plugin but it's the same principles. What you're doing is you're choosing the content that only that member can see inside your membership site. So you're restricting access based off their membership level and or their membership package that's been assigned to them. Again, we'll cover all that kind of stuff in another video, which is more in the membership site and membership building. But this is really the Samcart integration. So that was the process of doing an upsell inside Samcart, where the user gets added onto a new level or even a new package. So that is really it, guys. I hope you've found that one. I hope that's sort of answered a few questions. I've seen people asking what happens in the upsell process with Samcart. So really that's just that video to show you how the upsells work.